Hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Before proceeding to tutorial, I request you that please subscribe to my channel. To subscribe, click on this red subscribe button, and then click on bell icon, so that in future whenever I will upload a tutorial on my channel, you will be notified via email. Thank you. Okay. In this tutorial I am going to show you how to create neon text effect in Adobe Illustrator. Create a new document. Make sure that you choose RGB color mode, and choose raster effects, hi. I am going to drag out those panels which I am going to use in this tutorial. So go to Windows, choose Appearance, and then click on Appearance tab and drag it towards left side to move it out. Do the same for color guide, swatches, and transparency panels. I have moved out these four panels to make my work easier. Choose Rectangle tool, make a rectangle equal to the artboard size. Fill it with pure black color. And then lock it by going to Object, and then choosing Lock. After that choose type tool, and type your text. Change its color. I am typing neon, increase its size. I am using moonlight font. Select the text, right click, and choose create outline to convert your text into shape. After that go to object, path, and choose offset path, and put the value, 2 in offset text box. It will create another copy of our text at the same place having 2 millimeters thicker stroke outside. Click OK to apply. Now we have one group of two copies of our text. So first of all we have to ungroup it. Select the text, right click and choose ungroup. Now first select all inner text and group them. After selecting first character, hold down shift key to increase the selection. After selecting all internal text, go to object, and select group, to make a group of all internal selected text. Now we have group of inner text separated from outer one. Let me undo this. Do the same for outer text. So we have to also group it. Now I am selecting outer text. Group it with the same way. Then select outer text group. Double click on any color in swatches panel. Check on global. I am making pure blue. Click OK to apply color on the outer text. Now select the inner text. After selecting light a shade of blue from color guide panel. Go to Swatches panel and click on New icon to add this lighter shade of blue color in Swatches panel. You can see that lighter shade of blue color has been added into Swatches panel. Click and drag to put it near to our dark blue color global swatch. Select the outer blue text.
go to effect, blur, and then choose Gaussian blur, check on preview to see the effect real time, increase the radius value, and click OK to apply. I am also applying this same effect with very lower value to the inner text. Select blue text, go to edit, and choose copy, and then paste in front to make a copy of blue text at the exact same place in front of it. Our copy of this blue text is selected, go to appearance panel, and click on Gaussian blur to edit the effect. We can always change our effects from the appearance panel. Check on preview, and increase the radius. Click OK to apply. Then go to transparency panel and decrease the opacity little bit. Let me increase the radius of Gaussian blur effect. That's it. You can change the neon color with just one click. To do so double click on the dark blue global swatch that we have created earlier. Check on preview. Then move the sliders to change the color of our neon text easily. You can see that color of our neon text is changing real time. You can easily change the values of your effect later at any time, like I am changing opacity, and radius of Gaussian blur. I am also changing the color. So that was the tutorial how to create neon text effect in Adobe Illustrator. If you have any question, suggestion, or feedback, feel free to comment below. If you like my videos please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.